on, you guys. Guess what Mindy Melee woke up to today? Gooya! Oh my god! She's just like sitting on the other pillow in her box. Look how awesome! She is awesome! Oh wow. Okay. So, Shawnee totally ran out before I even woke up and he hunt Guya and whole hide! Ah! And he found him at Justice, a Justice we hadn't been to before. Or, he hadn't been to before, I haven't been to any Justice yet. He's been running around looking. And they totally had them and oh my god, they're so awesome! Oh my god, it's so awesome. You see her her cassette purse and her boots. They're like high heel converse. I wish I had knee high high heel converse. And her belt is a piano. And she's got the little arm warmer fishnet things. And check it out. Even her necklace like totally matches mine. I know. I don't think I have. Let's see what, what glasses do I have. It would be kind of... No. I don't really have glasses that would match. My black ones are like cat eye frames. A little bit. Got these though. So, update. I feel really good because I got some sleep. I got Valium yesterday from my doctor, and I saw my doctor. I went to the pain doctor, and um, it was a really good visit. We ended up doing an assessment for a motorized um, wheelchair scooter thing, and it would actually be like an upright chair, and um, it was like, it was really good that we did that, but like, my arm was really, really hurting yesterday. Like, before I even went to the doctor, like, it felt like it was bruised, and actually, like, this vein looked like it had exploded, like, a little bit. Kind of like what happened in my other arm when I went to the ER and they burst my veins. But, um, it was, uh, it was weird, because usually like when my arm is bothering me and I can't use my arm because it's causing me pain like using my arm is actually causing my like right leg to be pained but that that wasn't really how it was yesterday like my actual arm hurt so like to do like the the like I made a fist and like for hours after that appointment my arm just like hurt so bad so all my typing was really crappy yesterday <laughs> um but I uh yeah I um I talked to him about, like, the Embedda not being approved and everything, and I guess what we're gonna do is try, um, the, the MS Cotton, and I, I asked him, I asked him, I was like, well, what's the difference between those? Like, you, you know, you wanted me on the Embedda, and my insurance just sucks, which he just, like, flat out says my insurance sucks, like, he's so cool and, like, down to earth, and, um... And he was like, I hate MS Cotton. <laughs> like, oh, well, that's great. But we went to a Target to get my prescriptions filled. And they had just, like, filled a prescription for another patient and ran out of MS Cotton. So, like, my timing is just really, really bad, man. It's really funny. So I don't have any uh, pain medicine still. So it's going to be, like, another day in bed. But another day in bed with Gulia Yelps. Oh my god, she's so awesome. She looks great, too. It's, like, perfect. Like, everything about her is just, like, perfect. I love it. And oh my god, Sean is so happy to have Holt Hyde. Oh, and his Holt Hyde is so cool. I had no idea that his belt was a turntable. Oh my god, it's so crazy. Um, oh yeah, see the other thing that Sean got? Is a voodoo doll for Gulia with a <laughs> lime heart. <laughs> oh, it's so awesome. Oh my god, I love my snow snow so much. 
What a great way to wake up. Well, I think my stomach's actually growling. My stomach's been growling lately. It's been kind of weird. But, um... Do -do -do. I... I'm, like, out of some supplements, which is why I haven't made my video yet. Um... That and, like... All I can do is sit here in bed, and I need to set up, like, the actual video camera and stuff. But, um... I am gonna do that really soon. And, um... You know, hopefully, hopefully it'll, like, help you guys out that are dealing with Lyme or, like, any health issues, really. Like, all the stuff that I take, you know, it's, like, it's not prescription. It's just, like, natural stuff to, like, balance your body, like, naturally. And, um, it helps me immensely. Like, immensely. Um... What else do I have to update about? I don't even know. Um. Well, we have a new camera ordered, so I should have, like, my, my things, like, listed on my Etsy, like, pretty soon. And, um, I've got a lot of stuff. I've got a lot more to do for my Etsy. Like, a lot more to do. And as soon as I can get some pain medicine and, like get out of bed and move around, I'm gonna do that. Oh, yeah, like, the motor chair, like, all kinds of changes took place, like, January 1st, so, like, the one, like, the good one, she was, the representative was like, well, the good one, like, I can't, like, get you now because your health care doesn't cover that one, but it covers the, like, giant, like, chair thing, and, um, the problem is that there's, like, no room for that in our, in our room, like, at all, so it, it, it sounds, like, really stupid, but this is how it works. Like, you have to, like, need it in the home. And, like, if I was on a ranch, like, you know, if, like, we had our own place and I was on a ranch, then, like, oh, my God, that would enable me to, like, go to the kitchen and, like, do laundry and stuff and, like, get around the house and not be in bed all day. Um, oh, my God, I can even go outside. That's crazy. But here, living on the second floor of Sean's parents' house in a bedroom, like, there's no room for it, there's no room to use it, so, like, I don't think that's gonna work out, I think that it's not, it's probably not gonna be approved by my insurance, and I'm just gonna have to, like, buy one outright and just use it outside of the home, because it, to it totally makes a difference outside of the home, and eventually we're gonna have our own place, you know, like, I'm not living here for the rest of my life at all, and, uh, and when we have a ranch, then, you know, I'll have that, and it'll be awesome, so, <laughs> that's really cool. It's a little disappointing, because, like, I really, I really wanted that to work out, and it's just, like, so ridiculous, like, I called, I called my, my pain specialist, and I called my, like, primary care physician, like, a lot, a lot in December, like, trying to get an appointment set up, because no one even told us that all these changes were going to take place until, like, nine days until the end of the month, when the changes were taking place, and, um, nobody returned my calls, and when I was, like, at the doctor's office, he was like, gosh, you guys should have let me know, and, and I didn't know how to, like, tell him, like, without being just, like, a complete ass about everything, like, that I called his nurse, and Sean called his nurse, and that we leave messages, and she doesn't seem to, like, give them to him, and it's just, I, I don't want to, like, badmouth any, I don't want to badmouth anybody there, because they're all really nice, and, like, this is the only place that has ever, like, even given me, like, the time of day. Seriously. Like, my primary care physician, like, she was just, she was just, like, well, I'm just, I'm just gonna, like, give you something until you get a pain specialist, but I can't do this for long, but, like, it was really cool of her to give me medication, but it was not really cool of her to, just, like, cart me off to the emergency room and, like, not, not talk to the, the technicians there, like, because I got locked in that room, you know? It was because, like, my doctor wouldn't even take my call from the ER, so it was really messed up. Um, I've got an appointment to see my diagnostician, and that's, like, the closest thing to, like, a Lyme expert that I have. Like, he knows about Lyme, he has patients with Lyme, but I can't get a Lyme doctor. Like, at all. I've called everyone within, like, 50 miles of here, and I can't get a Lyme doctor. So, that's just how that is, and, um, when I go see him, I'm going to get my hormone levels tested, 
because I've been, like, taking things to regulate my hormones, like the evening primrose and the cat's claw. Those, um, those have made a huge difference. Like, even, like, if a day goes by, like, a couple days went by, because I couldn't, I couldn't even drink enough water to, like, take my pills. Like, that's, like, that's how bad it is. Like, I, I could only go to the bathroom, like, once for a couple of days, so I didn't take anything. And, um, as you can see, I'm, like, totally broken out, like, all over my nose and, like, my jawline, and it's just, like, ugh. It's so terrible. Um, but, yeah, that's... That's definitely a sign that it's working, like, if I stop taking it and I get all broken out, because, like, it's not natural for me to be broken out. Like, my skin used to be, like, porcelain. And, like, I know it sounds, like, really conceited to say that, but, like, no, I used to look like a china doll. And my skin is, like, it's terrible. Like, it's, like, red and my pores are big and I have breakouts. Like, I've never had so many pimples on my face. Like, I guess I was just, like, really lucky as a teenager to just, like, get, like, one, like, septic one around my period, and, like, really not much else. <sighs> my back knee is, like, totally clearing up since taking the cat's claw regularly. And, you know, like, back knee, that's, like... Those are all signs that, like, my testosterone is, like, like too high, which it's higher It's higher than my, my, like, female hormone levels, but, like, it's not even high enough to, like, like be, like, normal, like, levels. So, it's, it's just because they're out of balance. And that's why I take, like, natural things, because my body needs to know how to regulate itself, like, naturally. I don't want to, like, take something and, and then, like, have to take something for the rest of my life. Like, that's how, like, most prescriptions work, you know? And that really blows. But, um, I've got a lot of stuff to take. I should probably start downing those things now. But, uh... Shawnee's at the post office now, getting, like, everything sent out to everyone whose address I have, and, um, that is just really exciting because I had so much fun, like, shopping for people, and, um, you know, I really, like, it was really just, like, Sean that I was shopping for, like, outside of just my, my internet family and friends, so, um, that, that was just really really good for me, because I just, I just love to give, <laughs> I just love to give, like, to a fault, pretty much, but, um, yeah, I've got, oh, I'm so, I so want to make things on my Etsy, um, Sean and I are still working on the Monster High, like, New Year's comic that we've been making, and it's coming along very nicely. It's, like, so awesome. Oh my god, it's so totes cool. But it's not done. And it's, like, it's, like, a big, like, thing. Like, there's, like, several scenes, and there's, like, a lot of props, and, um, it's really cool. It's gonna be so hard, like, not to throw, like, Goya in there, even though she's, like, not written in the script, because I only had two dolls, like, when I started writing it, so, like, I have reasons for there not being, like, other dolls, but, um, yeah, I, I, you know, I think I'll do a video of, like, all the, the Monster High dolls that, that I've gotten, because it wasn't just Goya that, that he found, um, it's just Goya that, like, greeted me when I woke up today, so that's really cool. Well, I hope that everyone is having a beautiful day and feeling really good. I obviously have, like, tons of energy, which will probably be gone by, like, two, and I'll just be like, oh, zombie. Oh, zombie. But, um... I'm happy to be awake and have energy, like, right now, so, yay! <laughs> It'll just be, like, a challenge to, like, sit still and not do a lot of stuff, because I still don't have pain medicine, like, if, if I, like, go over that edge, but, dude, spending 22 or 23 hours in bed every day, like, that's not even an exaggeration, like, really, it's more like, like, 23 hours, like, I get out of bed to pee, and, like, that's it. Like, yesterday... I was gone from the house for a couple hours for my doctor's appointment, so that was probably, like, maybe, like, 20 hours I was in bed yesterday, but this is, this has got to stop. Like, I can't stand this. I, I need to do stuff, and 
I, I, I just, I deserve better than this. I deserve better than this. Oh my god, my tummy is really growling. This is so crazy. My stomach doesn't usually growl or I can't usually feel it because, like, I don't know, there's pain in there already. And, and, like, right now it's, it's just, like, growling and I'm hungry. Like, oh my god, that's such a good sign. That's such a good sign. Cool. Yeah, sleep does body good. And a mini mini mind. Okay. I love you all. Have a great day. Bye bye.